Hey everybody, today is uh, September 18th, uh, it is 8.16 p.m. and I have another uh, option with the MKSD4. This one has double tape uh, for, especially for the iPhones XS all the way to the 12 Pro Max and coming soon the 13. Uh, you just peel off the little sticker on the back, the yellow one or the gold color. You peel it off and you attach it to the SIM card. It has the same shape as your SIM card. Okay, so I'm gonna show you the way or the new way uh, for now that is working uh, unlocking the iPhones. Okay, let's begin. So I'm gonna take this off and I only have a Spectrum Mobile uh, active which is my carrier here in San Antonio. So I'm gonna put it in. And it's gonna take us to the activation screen. Dismiss, don't get too excited. If you see any signal, we just need to go to, we just need to go and follow the instructions. SIM not supported. Okay, and uh, as you know, the Apple sh shut down the ICC ID option for the smart card. If you purchase a smart card prior to September 17, uh, Apple just blocked this way. So we had to look for other solutions. Uh, and please uh, don't blame it on me. Apple was the one that blocked the ICC ID. I wish that we could continue doing the ICC ID semi-factory but there is this way basically this sim card is going to replace the smart card i show you so you're going to grab your iphone you're going to do the test and my iphone it is an iphone xr running ios 15 for obvious reasons and my iphone is sim lock okay so i'm going to close everything down and i'm going to grab my MKSD4, I'm gonna peel it off, just like that. Or you can see it, just like that, very carefully. Peel it off. And it has the same shape for your SIM card. I don't know if you can see it. So I'm just gonna put it on top of it, like a little sandwich. Just like that. Okay, as you can see, you can move around. It won't fall. Put it in. I'm just gonna wait for the menu for the... And I'm already configured with the most active ICC ID that is on the market for this new this new SIM lock. Uh, let me double check which one was it. It is ending 0651. It's on my website. It's still working. So let's begin then. It's already configured. Then I hit continue. So hopefully this will pick up. Nope. SIM not supported. Lock the iPhone. Okay, maybe it's my SIM card. Let me see. Let me take it out. And because we attach the, it has a little glue on it. I'm gonna very carefully deattach it from the SIM card. Okay, and then I'm gonna use, uh, let me see what I have available. I have an H20 SIM card. It's not active, just for my unlocking purposes. So I'm gonna reattach it. Okay, yes. 
do it again then, very carefully, put it in. Gonna wait for the screen, for the, this is the screen that I'm looking for. Okay, in this case, we are gonna select uh, ICC ID MNC. And we're gonna select ICC ID MC manual. And that's the last four zero six five one. It is ICC ID working. I'm gonna hit send. I'm gonna hit accept. It says my iPhone has been updated to iOS 15. Continue. So hopefully this time will unlock. Like I said, this is a work in progress. There we go. So our iPhone has been sim locked. Like the smart card used to do the same job, but in this case, we need to have a little more steps, uh, which I don't mind, but some people might get might don't like it because it's not simple and sometimes as you can see you need to change from uh if you if the menu doesn't pop up uh, the first time you need to uh, to reattach it to an, a different sim card for you to get this menu and from that you're good to go so we just go back to general about let me close everything so settings general about and once again iphone xr and voila no sim restrictions sometimes if you are using the same carrier or the same phone this phone belongs to uh it used to be a sprint iphone and then sprint was but uh, was purchased or merged to uh T-Mobile. Uh, it was picking up as a T-Mobile iPhone, but it's originally a Sprint iPhone. Uh, but if you're using or you want to use the same carrier, uh, I recommend you to, if you have, for instance, you're going to use T-Mobile for the same carrier, uh, I recommend you to get a different SIM card and do the unlock, and then you can put whatever SIM card you want. Uh, just FYI, okay? So now I can take this out. Thank you, MKZ4. Thank you for your help. Now, I'm gonna put it in, but this doesn't mean that it is up to the carrier now, to your carrier, if it is uh, be able to pick up the signal. I know some CDMA uh, networks out there, they're not working with this method yet. Uh, just be patient. What I recommend is to switch with one of the carriers uh, prepaid ones, T-Mobile, AT&T, uh, Cricket, Metro, Mint, US Mobile, uh, and there is some more, there are more, more a few more, but I couldn't recall the name of the, the companies, which is only, I'm familiar with those, AT&T prepaid, AT&T prepaid, uh, Verizon prepaid, uh, and then Cricket, Metro, and uh, everything with this GSM uh, network. But as of right now, as you can see guys, it is working for now. Welcome to Spectrum Mobile. This Spectrum Mobile. So let's take out the Wi-Fi just to check the signal. Still LTE. Let's do the speed test. So I don't have a great service here in my area where I'm at. Like I said, it's based on location, uh, but it's really cheap. So that's what I'm having those, uh, this plan, uh, but it works. I might not have a like 5G connection, but it, it, it does the work for me. Uh, if you want to go to, let's do another, let's go to Apple. So the internet it's working properly 
like I said, this goes it's based on location. I have the LTE connection, uh, which I can complain for $15 a month because uh, I'm connected to Wi-Fi most of the time. But it's working. It's working, people. Uh, NKSD4, my method is working. Uh, and I'm so sorry for the smart card uh, that is Apple, the one that blocked everything from the ICC ID. Uh, we're trying to look for new, find new ways. So this is another one. And I will post, I have another way for the Gaby Pro. I know I post one earlier. Uh, that was the first, that's the first uh, option or the first test that we did. And it works 100%. Now this is the second test with the MKSD4, and I'm going to do another test on Gaby Pro with the but with the different uh, steps. You see, it's going to be more more simpler. Okay, so keep eye on it. Bye, guys.